in any city, in any country, go to any museum or art gallery you can get yourself to. Approach an information desk and ask to see the holder of images. The worker may give you a blank stare, but eventually will turn and lead you through the very back of the building and stop at a large set of double doors. Upon opening the doors, you will find yourself standing before an unimaginably long corridor furnished with an elegant red carpet. As you walk forward, you will notice a variety of pictures lining the walls on either side of you. They will all look unnervingly familiar as they are paintings of your past memories. At the end of the hallway, you will see an enormous painting that covers the entirety of the wall. On it will be painted a detailed picture of another set of double doors. However, as you proceed, it would behoove you not to view the paintings, as they will become more distorted and horrifying with each step. Whatever you do, do not stop thinking about the double doors at the end of the hallway. If you take your mind off of them for more than a second, the large painting at the end of the hallway will start to fade. If the painting fades completely, the first thing that you think about most indescribably deformed. Mind you will replace the double doors, materialize from the canvas, and rip your pitiful body to shreds with these and devour your soul, making you wish you had been given the option to live in the depths of hell. If this should happen, feel free to run in the other direction, for the doors from which you entered will be gone, leaving in its place another stretch of hallway that extends far beyond infinity. If you somehow manage to keep your mind focused on the doors by the time you reach the painting, the doors will materialize as you reach for their handle. When you pull it open, you will see inside nothing but a white room with a single closed sketchbook propped up on top of a table. As you get closer to it, your mind will start to race with unspeakable images that will seem as vivid as though you were seeing them with our own eyes. Do not dwell on them for too long. If you do, you will forevermore live inside of your mind in a hellish nightmare far worse than anything the human mind is capable of conceiving. If this is to happen, and you are still sane enough to remember this, shot what will help us remember, and the images should stop. In addition, managing to reach the sketchbook will make the horrible images cease as well. That sketchbook is object 203 out of 538. The sketchbook allows the owner to save memories, detail, sometimes moving pictures that will invoke the same emotions, sounds, smells, and any other of the human senses unto the viewer when looked upon. However, the more memories saved in the sketchbook, the more the owner will lose their sanity.